What's going on guys, it's your boy J-Ho bringing you a brand new video and today is Friday which means Zer is back for week number 29. So let's take a look and see what he's bringing to us this weekend. I am God. So here we go, here's his exotic inventory for the weekend. Starting off with the Titan, we have the Ruin Wings Gauntlets. He first sold this back when the Dark Below DLC first dropped. And uh, since then, he hasn't sold it. So uh, if you missed out on that opportunity, you can go ahead and pick it up this time around. Um, its perks are heavy ammo drops more often and contains more ammo in each drop. Causing damage with a melee reduces your grenade cooldown and increased reload speed with special weapons. Really good. I recommend this 100% for Titans. For the Hunter, we have the Acleo Face Symbiote. Really good as well for Gunslinger Hunters. Increased grenade throw distance, golden gun gains an additional shot, and more super energy from grenade kills. Really good as well. I recommend this one 100% as well. And then for the Warlock, we have the Obsidian Mine. Increased grenade throw distance, increased super energy gains from killing minions of the darkness, and Nova Bomb kills reduce the cooldown of your next Nova Bomb. So really good. Um, I recommend this 100% as well just because it's pretty good in the thrall part of Crota Zen Raid. Also pretty fun to use because you can get your super really quickly and faster in a lot of PvE content. So really good. I like this helmet a lot as well. For the gun, we have the Mita Multi-Tool. I believe he sold this maybe once before, but he brought it back. Really good scout rifle. This weapon boosts move speed and fires on a hair trigger. And also radar stays active while aiming down sight. So really good. Um, pretty quickly. Um, you can pretty quickly move with this gun. That's what I was trying to say. I didn't know what I was saying. But anyways, it's really good in the thrall section as well. You can go through the lamps pretty quickly with this gun. Also, not bad in PvP as well. Um, I recommend this if you want to try out a new scout rifle. It's pretty good as well. And then for the upgrading of exotics, we have Aquifage Symbiote and a Crest of Alpha Lupi. Uh, this one's the better one, but you can always just buy it instead. Uh, we have Armamentarium and no backup plans. Armamentarium is better. And for these two, we have a Skull of Dire Ahamkara and Apotheosis Veil. I think Apotheosis Veil is better because it has use in Crotazan hard mode. Also, he has the Heavy Ammo Synthesis, so buy him up if you need some. As well as the Gauntlet Engram. So that's about it for week 29. I almost said 27. Thank you guys for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.